Get readings and salutations, relax, examination, and welcome back to Space Engineers Port Time Orbital Survival with me, Relax Gamer. So, what is our plan today? Well, I'm thinking it's going to be a shorter video because I got to recording this late, <laughs> but that might change. Uh, also, it appears that we are missing parts of our tower. Probably due to variety of things attacking it. Uh, we are also missing most of a solar pedal here. Looks like the hinge got taken out. And we are feeling some lag. I'm not going to lie to you because that is weird. And I don't understand why. We're still hitting about 59 frames or something around there. So it's just on my end that we are, are lagging like crazy. Right. So we need to figure out a way to get out of this area as soon as possible. Uh, we don't want to go back down to part time. But we also want to go to the alien planet, which is somewhere. Is that it? I don't entirely know. I think that might be the alien planet, maybe? Or is it over there? I don't know. I am really not sure which planet is which. Except I know that this planet here is per time. I don't know don't know where the Terran planet is. Uh, I also did a lot of trash cleanup, uh, miscellaneous things that were uh, floating around. I've gotten a decent amount of stuff trashed, trashed out, but we're probably gonna get some more drones attacking eventually here. So I want to load this ship up with as many materials as we can possibly load it up with. Which, like I said, means we're going to build a pipe. Um, I'm not entirely sure. Well, we could probably just build a pipe straight from here, right? Yeah. Yeah, we could definitely do that. Because I have a little bit of, a little bit of clearance underneath. But yeah, we want to load this up with as many, many, many materials as possible. And then uh, head on towards the alien planet. Uh, we'll probably drop by the moon. I have not been to that moon before. So that's going to be fun. I think there are creatures installed. I think the creatures are on, but I'm sure we'll figure that out in a moment. But right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a pipe from here to there and I'll bring you back in a moment. Okay. So I went a little further instead of just a pipeline. I created a double pipeline to try and level this out, but apparently it didn't quite work, I guess. You can still get in and get out. It's just not quite flush. Um, but that should be fine. It gets us there. The pipes are attached. It allows us to move supplies in and out. I might decide to put a sorter in here somewhere, probably under here. Is there attached to that? Yeah, I'll put a sorter in here. So that we can just shove everything into the base. Or into the not the base the carrier do that Rip some parts
Wait a minute. That doesn't look right. There we go. Now it's actually attached. Yay! And I guess what we can do here is we don't really need the ores. So if we set up the sorter to blacklist everything except ores, blacklist ores, okay, then it will pull everything into it. Which is great. I just have to click this and then it will drain the base and store all that stuff in here somewhere. Next, we've got to figure out a place to park these bad boys. Um, unfortunately, all the attachment points in the hangar here are all on the top so we're gonna have to modify that a little bit yeah so I'm gonna do that and I'll bring it back in a moment And we're back. Or actually, we were back a moment ago. But I am just loading up my ships here. Mainly to see if they can fit. fighter is gone and that's just how it happens what goes on this can fit in there right oh I don't know this one might be a little too tall oh just <laughs> just fits in here going to be uh oh uh, we're too tall guess I could just do something like no dang it It's got landing gear. That's something I can probably fix up in the future. That's annoying. Oh well. We can still plug it in. And we can close the door too. Perfect. Make sure all the dampers are off. There we go. The ship's loaded up. So the plan here is we are going to leave this base here. Some of these things are not hooked up. Oh. Huh. 
Okay. Well, all the parts are going in here now. So... Let's grab a conveyor block. Still not hooked up? Ah, I see. Took a little bit of damage in here. Because that's draining everything, right? We didn't take any damage there. Interesting. Was some damage here. Uh, I'm not quite sure how that happened unless it was from explosions. It's quite possible. Explosions set it off. That is connected. This is all green. Good. This is all green, awesome. I'm assuming the cargo containers on board this ship are full. Oh, they shouldn't be. They have a whole bunch of smoke cargo containers too. Or maybe they can't get to it. check the connectors yeah it's not looking like they can actually push through okay it might be that one conveyor over there successful we have a broken conveyor in here goes there that goes there There's got to be some broken connector connectors. Lots of other things. Cargo ship. Oh, it's not called cargo, it's called container. Not 
entirely sure what's going on here. Because they can go through fine. That's cool. So our refinery is still refining. Um, eventually I'm going to tear this ship apart. Eventually. Probably not for a while yet. Okay, so we have loaded our ships on board. And close. Nothing's getting in the way. That's all done. That's all done. That's all connected. This is still carving out some stuff, which we don't really need. But in the next episode, like I said, this episode's gonna be short, I think. I haven't been watching the time. But in the next episode, we are going to take the carrier and make a jump. We'll make a jump towards the alien planet, whichever that planet is, we might have to get closer and figure out which is which. I think that's a Terran planet over there. It's a Mars-like planet. I think that's the alien planet over there. Over there. Right there. Because down there is Triton. Alien planet. And on our way to the alien planet, we'll uh, look into tearing apart the other cargo bay. I might actually just tear apart this entire thing and uh, make it a pass through. Not entirely sure how I'm going to manage that. So I guess I guess it's easy enough to get across to the other side. Yeah. And in here is where we're going to build our uh, landing vehicle. I think these are supposed to be bunks. Or shelves. Not sure. But we're going to build our landing vehicle in here. We'll be tearing these things out. In fact, I'll start with this. Actually, let's just do that. And we even have some interesting things that we can install on this, like uh, a special, what is it, gyro. Did I? Oh, no. That's not installed. Yeah, that's not installed. Okay. Well, maybe I'll install that mod next time. The Capital Ship Gyro mod or whatever it's called. I'll have to look it up. Uh, but until next time, I have been Lax Gaming. I will see you guys in the next one. Ciao.